Hello, thank you so much for coming back to watch my new channel. So every Friday I'm going to be uploading a um, food item that's at the Dollar Tree. So this week, very first week, it's going to be on the Chef Carlin New Orleans style jambalaya mix. So if you'd like to see if this is a Dollar Tree item you need to be picking up, if this is a dupe for the Zatarans, then please keep on watching. Just so you know, I do upload a daily video on this channel as well about food items. So it can be a taste test, a Dollar Tree food item, a recipe, um, little tips and stuff like that. So make sure that you subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell, turn on to all, so that way you are notified when I upload, which is daily. So, like I said, this is from Dollar Tree, and this is the Chef Carlin New Orleans style jambalaya mix. So... So this is an 8 ounce box, okay, it does have 5 servings in it, okay, so a serving is 160 calories, okay, um, so the ingredients, so it has enriched parboiled long grain rice, um, it has malodextrin, salt, onion powder, paprika, spices, red and green bell peppers, yeast extract, um, garlic, and natural flavor. So, you know, for a pre-packaged item this does seem to be pretty pretty low on the ingredients list okay so 160 calories um, total fat is 0.5 grams so half a gram saturated fat is saturated fat is zero trans fat is zero cholesterol is zero sodium it's a little high on sodium it's 40 480 milligrams um, 34 grams of carbs dietary fibers one gram sugars one gram um, three grams of protein so um, let's see here. Best Buy. I think people are sometimes scared to purchase things from Dollar Tree. So September 22nd of 2019. So this is being filmed before September 22nd. But anyway, I'm going to be making this tonight to share with you. So let's see if it's a dupe for the Zatarans Jambalaya. So this rice doesn't have any meat or anything in it. You can totally add your own meat. Um, I personally, we like to use um, a half a pound of spicy sausage, the hot sausage. So I'm going to go ahead and get this all browned up, and then I'll go ahead and open up the rice so you can see what it looks like. Okay, so my meat's almost done being browned. So I'm going to go ahead and open this up. Okay, so it just comes in a little white pouch. Okay. Okay, so this is what it looks like dry. Okay, so big clump of seasoning with some rice. Okay, so what we're going to do now is we're going to be adding two and a half cups of water, um, and it does call for two tablespoons of vegetable oil. Obviously, there's oil in here from the meat, so I'm not going to be adding that, but... Okay, now we're just going to let this come to a boil. Okay, so my water is coming to a boil, so I'm going to go ahead and add the rice. I'm going to give it a good stir. So after the good stir, we're going to turn it down to medium-low and cover it, and we're going to let it cook for 25 minutes. There we go. Okay, so the timer just went off, and this is what it's looking like. So. Give it a good stir, and then I'm going to go ahead and dish it up and try it and give you my opinions and everything. Okay, so I'm going to be serving it with a side of veggies, but... So this is what it looks like. Okay. So, there we go. Honestly, we really love this stuff. This is not the first time we've tried it. It is just as good as the Zatarain's um, Jambalaya. Super, super good. A lot of flavor. 
with the spicy sausage, it's not too spicy. But if I get the hot, like, kibasa sausage, like, in the big, like, kind of horseshoe shape, if I use that, then for me personally, it is a little spicy. But a lot of spice, a lot of flavor. It's really, really good for a dollar. Just as good as the Zatarans. Um, we really, really like this. And we actually do buy this. I'm a, I always go and buy five or six um, when we start running low. Super fast, super affordable for a buck. Heck yeah, it is definitely worth picking up at your local Dollar Tree. So anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Like I said, every Friday I'm going to be trying a Dollar Tree food item. So that way you know what you should pick up and maybe what you shouldn't pick up. But anyway, I hope you did enjoy it. If you did, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up and share it. Not only does it get the word out on a really awesome, affordable meal option, but also sh um, shows that you're enjoying my content, which I would appreciate. Go ahead and leave a comment down below. Have you ever, what is your favorite thing that you've picked up at your local dollar store that was a food item? Let me know down below in the comments. Don't forget, you're always welcome to follow me on my other social media, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. It's all at Budget Glam, babe. I will see you tomorrow for another video.